final revelation, right? No, it's not. No. The Quran is the final revelation of the devil. No, the Quran is the revelation of the devil. What do you mean, devil? Devil, devil, devil. Explain, explain. Shaitan. 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 Yeah. The majesty, the majesty. No, no it's not majesty, no. What does it mean? No. What does it mean? Al Mutakabi means the proud one. Proud, proud majestic. Yeah. Proud majestic. No, and it's not majestic. Majestic and majestic, the proud one is the proud one. So according to my Bible, your Allah is the devil of my Bible. Yeah. I'll, I'll tell you why. I'll tell you why. I'll tell you why. And by the way, that's an Old Testament. You must believe it. You must believe it as a Muslim. Now, uh, no, it's not. You are a liar. You are a liar. Look what he said. Lucifer. What is Lucifer mean? In, 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 in Hebrew. What is Lucifer in Hebrew? Uh, uh, by God. I'm asking because you are Christian. You should know. Are you are Christian. That's why. Okay. We got when the the Muslims they sacrifice animal. That chicken or that cow they call halal. Halal. H a l e l. Halal. And that's why I say H a l a l. Halal. Lucifer in Hebrew means hilal. H e l e l. Hilal. That is the meaning of Lucifer's. Has your good uh, uh, no, it's not changed. You are a liar. No, it's not. Let me ask you a question. Let me ask you a question. How are the fallen? Listen, listen. The Quran is only one. Listen, Isaiah, Habibi, brother. No, let me ask you a question. In Isaiah, Ishaya in Arabic. In Isaiah, Habibi, Habibi, listen. Habibi, listen, listen. Let me ask you a question. Let me ask you a question. No, no. Let me ask you a question. He wants to speak. He wants to speak. Otherwise, I'm going to go back to my 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 preaching. Let me answer your question first. Ask your question first. Why did Allah is the devil of my Bible? Why? I'll tell you why. Why did Allah is the devil of my Bible? Let me ask you a question. What if the name of Allah is Al Mutakabir? What would you say if I told you that the Catholic Church created Islam to take over the as a strategy to take over the Holy Land? To answer this question very quickly, the Quran was written by Zaid ibn Zabid, a companion of the Prophet, at the time of the Messenger. Since then, hasn't been transferred or changed. Whatsoever. Yes, it does. Yeah, it has. What's I'm the proof? Prove that to me. I'm going to prove it to you. Feel free. The manuscript is in Birmingham University. Birmingham, 19, 19 paper, chapter Let, 19. Let's come back, brother. I need, I need. You were saying, anyway. So back Let me ask you a question first. Yeah. So what was your question? No, no, your question. I said your question. I remember your question. What was your question? I said Allah of your Quran is the devil of my Bible. I said you show me. And what, was the, what was the reason? Isaiah <laughs> no, yeah, yeah, chapter 14, no. verse from verse 12. How are thou fallen from heaven, O Lucifer, son of the morning? How are thou cut down to the ground, which did weaken the nation? For thou hast said in thine heart, I will ascend into heaven. I will exalt my throne upon the stars of God. I will sit as one upon the mountain of the congregation in the sight of the north. Hold on, hold on. I will ascend above the height of the cloud, and I will be like the most high. That's right. But how does that prove that Islam is a devil or the Quran is a devil? How does that prove? <coughs> Because the name of the devil, Satan, God changed from Lucifer to Satan, which means the devil. But how does this verse? That verse, because because the devil said, "I will, I will, I will, I will," and God said, "No, you want, you want." I did prove it to you. I did prove it to you. I did prove it to you. You don't listen. You are dumb and deaf. You don't listen with my due respect. No, I'm not delusional, my friend. I got a savior. I got a savior. I got a savior. Let's come back to the word of God. Let's come back to the word of God. In Second Peter, in Second Peter, run away because you I came in. Let me tell you something. I don't know who you are, but I know who Jesus Christ is. Because before Christmas, I sent Jesus Christ to hell. Before he was in hell, I saw him in hell. I said, oh God, I am back into the world. I became like a child of the devil. If you are truly and sincerely and honestly the son of God, show me a sign that I may leave this world and come back to you. And I was asleep. I slept. 
That night I slept like, like no any other night because I challenged God. After 11 years journey, after 11 years walking with Jesus Christ, I became what a child of devil for two weeks and start drinking, smoking, and doing stuff which God hated. And I saw Jesus in hell. I'm no lying, man. I'm not lying. That's the last dream I had about Jesus Christ. I saw him in hell. The hell was burning because Jesus Christ described hell more than anything else in the Bible. Jesus Christ was in hell. I saw the face of Jesus Christ in hell. His face was not burning, mama. His face was not burning. And he went ahead in order for me not to inherit or to go to hell. Because I believe hell is real, mama, as much as heaven is real. And let me tell you something. It's never too late and never too early. I don't know how old are you, maybe 15, 16, 17, 18, maybe you're at university. Sir, are you in university? 17. Are you in college? Uh, what do you study, sir? Huh? No, and what's your subject? subject? What's your subject? Economics. economics. Thank you very much. Do you know in economics, Jesus Christ, in economy, listen carefully, in economics, he disproved the law of diminishing return by feeding 5,000 men with two fish and five loaves of bread. Here we go, here we go. Who wrote the Bible? And you go to university. I don't know how much money your mama paid for your university. Every per seminar, I think you pay an undergraduate maybe 3,000, 4,000 pounds per year, yeah? But they will never teach you to fear God. They will never teach you to live a moral life. They said you evolved, you came from fish and monkey. While my Bible said God created man in his own image, in the image of God, created them transgender, by gender, above gender, beneath gender, and then male and female. He never says that. He never said God created transgender, by gender, above gender, beneath gender. He said he created them male and female. So there's no queers in Male and female. That means you are a boy, you're going to be a man. I am a girl, I'm going to be a woman. So I have respect for the alphabet people, man. My manager is the alphabet people. I have many alphabet people, more than Christian friends. And I love them and I hug them. And they know I love them and they know I hate the action of their sin. And the question is, sir, it's not too late or too early. To give your life to Jesus Christ. If you're gay, you because no no, because Jesus Christ challenged a religious people like him. Jesus Christ challenged any other major religion by saying, by saying, by saying, by saying, by saying, I am. No, I will, no, I was, no, I will be. I am com present continuous. I am the way, the truth, and the life. Man. Is that your mommy? May God bless you.